On today's Kids Corner, the unthinkable happens to Liz. Your loved one has been taken. Oh, no. If you wish to see your loved one again, you what? will do as we say. Oh, no. You will receive your next instruction tomorrow noon at Dublin Connolly. Do not involve the Garda or we cannot assure your loved one's safety. Oh, oh no. Liz has been kidnapped? Oh, no. Stay tuned. Taxi is here, Dad. Come on, it's time to go. All right, okay, Liz. I'm just making some last second checks. Come on. Now, let's see. We have our ID, passports, boarding passes. Yes. Looks like we're all set for our Ireland adventure. Oh, I can't wait to meet Evan. Yeah. As far as I can tell from the emails we wrote to each other, he's about my age. Yeah. You two be careful now. Oh, Mom. The last time you went off on a spring break adventure, Liz spent a day in the sewer. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to forget that for a long <laughs> no. time. But we did learn that God is in control of every situation. Yep. Just like he is now for this trip. We'll be fine, dear. Yeah, Mom. Nothing like that is going to happen this time. Mm. Well, for one thing, spring is the driest time of the year in Ireland. Oh, well, I'm still a mom, and I, and I worry about All you. Right. Uh, call me when you get there. We will, dear. <sighs> Uh, oh, we oh, better get going. Yeah. We'll need all the time we can get to make our way through the airport security. Yeah, come on. Uh, goodbye, dear. Mm. We'll see you next week. Oh, and goodbye. Liz, remember to stay close to your father. A- and don't talk to strangers. Yeah, I know, Mom. Liz. And I've got a cell phone just in case. Yes, don't worry. I'll keep an eye on Liz at all times. Come on, Dad. All Let's right. get our bags in the taxi. Oh, gentlemen, you have a great day for flying today. Yes, I think you're right, Bill. Dad, hmm? how did you know the cab driver's name? Oh, it's on the driver's ID card on the back of the seat in front of you. Oh. Uh, is there something wrong? Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, we're just discussing your ID card. Oh. Uh, from your last name, can I assume there is some Irish ancestry in your family? <laughs> yes, yes. Uh-huh. My grandparents came from Ireland. Oh, really? So. Oh, mm-hmm. cool. We're going to Ireland. Oh, uh, really now? Yeah. So what business do you have there? Well, I'm going to help a boy named Evan start an internet radio station. Oh, that's right. Uh, you don't say. Yeah. And uh, where does Evan live? Oh, he wrote to me and said that he lived outside of a town called uh, Louth. Uh, you mean in Louth? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, county Louth? Yeah, Evan did say that the town and the county have the same name. Uh-huh. It's north of Dublin, which is the capital city of Ireland. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah. Are you familiar with that area, Bill? Oh, as a matter of fact, I am. Really? See, my grandparents came from Dundalk, which is just north of Louth. Oh, wow. Louth is the smallest town in the smallest county in Ireland. Oh, cool. There's not much there to speak of. Just a few houses and some old church buildings that fell apart a long time ago. Uh, well, it is soon also going to have an internet radio station. Oh, yep. oh well, <laughs> that little town will really have something going for it then, yeah. huh? <laughs> okay, here we are, gentlemen. Huh. The International Terminal. Oh, cool. oh uh, can I help you with your bags? Uh, well, thanks, Bill, but I think we can handle them all right. All right. <laughs> Hey, Maury. Oh, hi, Lucille. Hey, Cammie. Hi, Liz. Ooh, man, this place sure is busy. Mm -hmm. We were wondering if we'd ever be able to find you, okay? This is a good sign. Oh, yeah. Uh, You want to hear something else? Our cab driver's grandparents came from Ireland, Uh and he knows about the town that Evan lives in. Another good sign. (laughs) Yeah. And look, I found this penny on the sidewalk a few minutes ago. Okay. Can this trip get any luckier? Uh, Well, (laughs) while it is natural to seek causation, random occurrences should not be attributed to providential entities. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, what? Uh There's no such thing as luck. (laughs) That's right, Cammy. There Mm -hmm. is no such thing as luck. When you believe in God, he's in control of everything. No, no, that's not what I'm saying. I Hmm? believe there is no such thing as luck because it cannot be proved by science or reason, Lucille. Well, I still think this penny is lucky. Especially when I didn't have one before I found (laughs) it. Well, that's true. (laughs) Oh, good. Hey, looks like we found each other okay. Yeah. Hello, Lucille. Maureen, Cammie. Hi, Mr. Lucille. Hey. 
Hello, Harry. I got the kids' boarding passes validated, and their baggage is already checked. Mm, good. We were just waiting for you to arrive. Oh, that's great, Anna. Now, I'll just get our passes registered and luggage checked, and we'll be ready to go. Oh, oh this wow. is so exciting, isn't it, Liz? Mm-hmm. Oh, it sure is, Mrs. Monitor. Mm-hmm. Everything just kind of fell into place to make this trip happen. Yeah. I feel really good about it. Mm-hmm. Mom, you won't forget to feed my fish while I'm gone, will you? Oh, no. <laughs> no, Lucille, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, she takes just one shake of fish food at exactly 7 o'clock... Every morning. Exactly 7 o'clock. All right, I think I got it. One <laughs> shake at 7 o'clock. All set, Anna. Oh, now good. I'll keep a good eye on Lucille and the others. You don't have to worry about anything. You know, you did such a fine job, Harry, with everyone in Cayman City last year. I have full confidence in you now. All right. Mm. Way to go, Dad. All right, kids. <laughs> we have to get to gate uh, E17. Oh, ah, let's get started. It's going to be quite a hike. All right. Oh, All right. right. Let's, let's do it. I can't wait. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. Have a great trip. Bye, Goodbye. Hi, good morning, everyone. Good morning. May I see your boarding passes and passports, okay. please? All right, kids, go ahead. All right. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. All right, thank you. Um, young man. Yes, ma'am. Uh, any particular reason for the expression on your face uh, in your passport photo here? Oh, that. Yeah, I hiccup just as the camera guy took my picture. Oh, That's why my mouth is open and my eyes are crossed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but you're going to have to prove to me that this picture is really you before I can uh, let you go through the gate. Uh, what? How? Well, by making the exact face for me right now. Oh, oh. Cool. You mean like this? <laughs> oh, Maury. Oh, That's pretty, Maury. <laughs> well, that's you, all right. All right, you may pass. Mm-hmm. Please don't make me repeat the expression on my photo. Oh, come on, Dad. Ah, you're all right, sir. Oh, thanks. All of you may proceed now to the metal detector. Have a good trip. Right. Yeah, thanks. Be well. All right, everyone. One at a time. Pass slowly through the opening. Okay. Okay. Here you go. okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Woohoo! Okay. Good. Fine. Oh, here I go. Uh-huh. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, son. Uh-huh. Please uh-huh. back up and pass through the metal detector again. Uh-huh. Um, okay. Hmm. Remove your belt and pass through the detector again, please. Oh, okay. Uh, yes, sir. Son, are you wearing any metal jewelry under your clothing? <laughs> jewelry? Uh, I mean, no, sir. No metal plates or other surgical items inside you? Well, not since the mad scientist that built me removed the electrodes from the side of my neck. Yeah, yeah. Maury, this, this what is, is doing? serious, Maury. Uh, yeah. If they can't identify what's making the metal detector go off, you won't be allowed to board the plane. Oh, no. no. Okay, Maury, come mm-hmm. on Hold still. Let me pass this wand around you. Whoa. What do you got in there? What do you have in your pocket? Yeah, oh, nothing. I don't have any... Uh, Oh, you mean this? What is it, sir? (laughs) It's a penny. It's it's my lucky penny. (laughs) Do I have to turn it in? (laughs) No no need for that, son. You may all proceed to your gate. Have a good flight. Thank you, sir. Oh, boy, your lucky penny almost got you kicked off our plane, Maury. Well, I still say it's a good thing I found it. Why is that? Well, we know for sure that the metal detector's working okay. (laughs) Uh, Okay, (laughs) yes. Maury. to meet Evan. Oh, I'd sure like to know what it's like being a kid in Ireland. Well, you'll get to meet him when he and his father meet us at the Dublin airport. I know. Of course, being a boy, he'll have more in common with me and Maury than he will with you and Cammie. Oh, yeah, well, we'll see about that. And speaking of Maury, is he still in the bathroom? Yeah, well... We've all got to be buckled in our seats now. Oh, wowie. Zowie, I'm back. Maury. Pretty rough flight, huh, Maury? It's getting better, I think. Now that it's almost over. Yeah. Uh, any waste items here? Need anything else, young man? More air sickness bags? No, ma'am. The five bags that you brought me during the flight pretty much took care of things. Oh. Well, take care of yourself on the ground. The effects of air sickness can last for up to eight hours. Eight hours? 
Maybe I will take another air sickness bag. Oh, yeah, I think you should. Do they still call it air sickness if I'm on the ground when it happens? I don't <laughs> think so. Liz, how will we know who to look for at the airport? Oh, well, Evan said he'll meet us in the main terminal on the way to the baggage pickup. Oh, okay. And he'll be holding a big sign that says Lacerda on it. Okay. Hey, hey, look out the window. There's the airport down there. Oh, oh wow. I'd rather not look down. Okay. Don't worry, Maury. Once we get on the ground, okay. it's all downhill from there. Oh, i just as soon avoid any hills when we get on the ground, too. Oh. Thank you for flying with us today. Bye-bye. Have a good trip. Bye. Thank you. Now, where should we go to pick up our luggage? A luggage area B, carousel number 13. Uh, B13. Got it. Thank you. All right, kids, stay with me. Okay. This airport may be quite crowded. Oh, yeah. All right. Liz, I didn't think to ask before, but um, how are we going to get to where Evan lives? <laughs> We're not going to be on another plane, if that's no. what you're worried about, mm. Maury. That's good. Yeah. No, Evan said we'd be taking a bus, but some of the country roads on the way to Louth might be kind of bumpy. Mm. Oh, not so good. Sorry. Whoa. Wow. Look at Whoa. that crowd. A lot yeah. of people. We really better make sure we stick together. Yeah. Good idea. That's good advice, Lucille. Let's all stay together. Yeah, mm-hmm. let's. Oh, whoa, oh, that sign says the baggage area is to the left. Come oh, on, let's go. Liz, 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 what, Liz what? stay with the group. What? Yeah. We just said that we should all stick together. Now, don't go run off by yourself. All right, I'm sorry. I'm just so excited about meeting Evan. Mm, yeah. I understand, Liz. Uh, now just be patient. I'm trying. Oh. Man, there's lots of people holding signs with names on them. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah but how many Lacertas can there be here in Ireland? <laughs> True. Well, more than you may realize, oh, Liz. What? Lacerta lizards are very common in Europe. Oh, huh? mm-hmm. Yeah, I see four signs with Lacerta on mm. Oh, look, there's two more over there. Yeah. And I see three more over that way. Mm. Oh. Okay, uh, wow. this may take a little while. Mm-hmm. All, right, all right, look for a grown-up and a boy with a Lacerta sign. All, all right. right. The ones I see are just one person holding the sign all by themselves. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And those over there we have... Three or even more people with the sign. Mm-hmm, right? mm-hmm. Same here, except for a grown-up and a girl with a sign. Mm-hmm. Well, maybe Evan and his dad haven't gotten here yet. Mm-hmm. Maybe they got stuck in traffic or something. Well, mm-hmm. perhaps we should call them and find out where they are. Yeah, that's a good idea. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a really good idea. Except I didn't get Evan's phone number. Oh, oh Liz. Well, sorry. then it looks like we'll just have to wait a little and see what happens. Okay, I'm starting to get worried. Now, no, Maury. there's no need to worry, Maury. I'm sure there's just a simple explanation why they're not here yet. Uh, hello? Hello. Hi. Uh, pardon my interruption. My daughter and I noticed that you seem to be looking for someone. Mm-hmm. Uh, your last name wouldn't happen to be Lacerta, would it? Oh, why, yeah. yes it is. Then again, there seems to be quite a few Lacertas here at the airport today. Yeah. <laughs> but we're looking for a man and a boy. Mm-hmm. Oh, my dad and I are looking for a man and a girl with the last name of Lacerta, oh. along with three of her friends. Mm. We thought that you might be them. Sorry, no mm. girl's name was Serta in this crew. No. But, uh, I'm getting worried that something may have happened to them. Oh, no, no, no. There's no need to worry, dear one. I'm sure there's a simple explanation why they're not here yet. Uh, perhaps we could ring them. Well, yes, but I forgot to get a phone number. Uh, no, oh, no, no. That sounds familiar. Yeah, yeah, okay, Maury, don't rub it in. Well, you folks are welcome to wait with us until uh. one of us finds our welcoming party. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure that we can wait any longer, oh, kids. God. Now we'll just have to go on and get our luggage, or we'll risk missing our bus. But what about Evan and his dad? Yeah, what about them? We can't just leave. Well, we'll just have to go on and hope we can catch up with them later. Uh, yeah. We're in the same predicament. Uh, the last bus to Louth leaves in about uh, mm, half an hour. Wait, you're going to Louth? Hey, so uh-huh. are we. Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Dad, maybe they missed their flight, or maybe maybe they're not coming at all. Oh, no, 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 dear one, don't fret. The Lord God is in control. If he wills it for you to start an internet radio station, it will be so. Wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. You're going to Louth, mm-hmm. and you want to start an internet radio station? Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, maybe you know Evan. That's who we're looking for. Sure, sure. Uh-huh. My name is sometimes confused with Evan, but it's pronounced Avon, which is a girl's name. What? I'm looking for a girl named Liz. But I'm Liz. Uh-huh. But you're a boy. And you're a girl. Mm. Well, now that we have the obvious stuff out of the way, <laughs> woohoo! We found each yeah. other and didn't oh. even know it. Well, I was that? expecting a boy named Evan. Huh. And I was expecting a girl named Liz. Oh, man. Yeah, I get that a lot. <laughs> so do I. Oh, I'm so glad you made it all right. Yeah. Well, mostly all right. Well, yeah. I beg your pardon? Um, I'll explain it on the bus ride aloud. Yeah, it'll take a while. <laughs> Liz, I might have recognized you by your voice, but... 
You don't sound like you do on the radio. Oh, that? Oh, that's my announcer voice. <clears throat> hey, does this sound more like me? Yeah. <laughs> Indeed, it does sound like you now. Oh, 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 well, well, c- come now. We'll have to hurry to make up for the lost time. Oh, well, right. yeah. Oh, we'd better go get our luggage so oh, we don't yeah. miss the bus. No, oh, Liz, Liz, come back here. We're supposed to stick together. Liz! No way are we going to miss that bus. Okay, let's see. Uh, carousel 13, there it is. Oh, and there's my suitcase underneath some of the rags. I'll just lean in and grab it as it goes by. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 ow, ow, I'm stuck in the luggage conveyor. Oh, now I'm about to go through that little door. Look here, Miara. Oh, what is it, Neil? A wee lad riding the baggage carousel. Here, here, let me get you now. Oh, thanks for getting me off of that thing. Oh, so strange to see a lad all by himself in such a busy place as this. Oh. Oh, where are your mom and dad, pray tell? Oh, I just ran ahead to get our bags. They're back there Oh, somewhere. listen to him, Miara, in American accent. Yeah. It's providence, I tell you. Oh, indeed it is, Neil. He'll fetch a higher price for sorcery. Oh, yes. Um, I'm not sure what you're talking about, but, um, I'm just gonna get together my bags and be on my way now, okay? So, uh, oh. thanks, but, Lad, um, no need for that. What? You'll be coming along with us oh, now. What are you talking about? Neil? Hey, get it. Hey, with hey, pleasure. What? what? You can't do this! Hey, let me go! Do this? Oh. Quickly, take his mouth and throw him in the suitcase okay. while the baggage area is still empty. Okay. Hurry! The next group will be here any minute to pick up their luggage. Okay, and... Got him. Now, you'll be a wise lad to keep the thrashing and noise to a minimum. Now, place the bag on this cart. Okay. Now, walk calmly and slowly out of the building. Calmly and slowly. Calmly and slowly. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I'm sorry. I hope I didn't hurt you. No. We were just in a hurry to get to the baggage carousel. No harm done. We're, we're just picking up our parcel to, to take home with us. Uh, don't mind me. He can be rather... Clumsy at times. Oh, that's all right. Have a good day and welcome to Ireland. Oh, thank you. Wow, the people here in Ireland are really friendly, aren't they? Oh, I'd mm-hmm. say. Hey, I don't see anyone at Carousel 13. Liz? Are you here, Liz? You don't suppose mm-hmm. he got lost? Hmm. Liz! Oh, look Liz. at this! No, what is it, Maury? It's Liz's suitcase here on the floor. Oh. Oh. And it has a note on it. Oh. Let me see that, Maury. Um, your love. One has been taken. Oh, no. If you wish to see your loved one again, you what? will do as we say. Oh, no. You will receive your next instruction tomorrow noon at Dublin Connolly. Do not involve the garden, or we cannot assure your loved one's safety. Oh, oh no. Liz has been kidnapped? Oh, oh no. Oh, what's Dublin Connolly? And why would anyone want to kidnap Liz? And What's the garden? Oh, the garden is what they call police in Ireland, Maury. Mm-hmm. Oh. You see, uh, Dublin Connolly is one of the main train stations in the city. Oh. There's been an outbreak of kidnappings of late. Oh, my. There are some evil ones who hope to gain by kidnapping the children of tourists. Oh, oh no. The guards think it's the work of a kidnapping ring. Kidnappers. Oh, Dad, what have I gotten Liz into? Oh, no, no, don't be blaming yourself for what has befallen Liz. It's not your fault. Remember what I told you about God being in control of all things? That's right. Yes, but why would God allow something terrible like this to happen? Mm. And after the good things we were planning at the radio station? Uh, We may not know the reason now, but like your father said, we can trust God. Mm. What do we do now? Well, first we'll pray. Dear Father, please protect Liz and bring him back to us soon. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. And now, we must contact the authorities. Yes. But the note said not to. Yeah, or right. else. Oh, no, no, don't be worrying about that. Mm-hmm. The guards know how to deal with these situations without making themselves obvious. Oh, good. You see, the good thing so far is that every kidnapped child has been returned safely. Oh, that's so good. These kidnappers are not killers, but uh, they're very, very cunning. Mm. You lock the keys in our car, didn't you? Now we gotta break into our own car. Oh, calm down, Yar. We'll be able to afford two new cars after we receive the ransom for this lad. An American will fetch us a rich price indeed. There, it's unlocked. Good. Place the lad in the back and let's head for home. Come on, lad. Get out of this. Get out of the suitcase there. And, uh, come on. Now, I'll, I'll take that tape off your mouth if you promise to be quiet. Mm-hmm. 
Ow! Why are you doing this? Where are you taking me? Uh, we're doing this to make our own private fortune from the tourism industry. What? As the child of a rich American, you bring us quite a rest. No, we're not rich. And as for where we're taking you, well, that's not for you to know. Come on, just We don't let wish me... to make it easy for the guard to track us down. No. Neil, the blindfold. Oh, come on now. <laughs> Lights out, little lad. Oh. There, it's on. Now, don't you try anything brave and you won't get hurt. Neil, this is daft. A getaway car that barely runs. And with a broken window. Like I said, we'll soon have enough money for two cars. Oh my, Liz is definitely in trouble now. And after traveling all the way to Ireland to help Avon spread God's word with her own internet radio station. Sometimes bad things happen even when we're trying to do good. But that's when we have to remember that God is in control and He works out everything to fit His plan and purpose. Join us next time to find out what happens next on Kids Corner. <laughs>